Hey everyone, here to show you a quick little way to go and change your settings on your computer so that your computer and your projector can communicate. Uh, there's two ways roughly quickly to go about doing this. Uh, the first way just simply requires you to click on the uh, start button, the control panel. I know it's a bunch of listing of items here. You want to just click where it says search control panel. And you may find that you actually have to re-click on the box here to get the word projector typed in. Once you do that, you got connect to a projector, just a quick little click on it. And then you've got uh, duplicate, which would be the clone. For those of you who remember cloning your screen, so that means what you see on the screen is the same thing on the projector. Uh, or you can click extend, which means you've got your screen here, and you can drag your windows off of your desktop screen onto the extension, which is your projector. So whatever whatever you slide over, your kids can actually see, which kind of is a nice way to go and keep your screen uh, away from what the kids are, are seeing, especially if you're doing grading and then so on and so forth. But uh, most people go with the duplicate function, extend is available. So anyhow, uh, that's one way to take care of this. The other way is just simply to right click on a blank space in your desktop, click on screen resolution, and from here, You'll notice where it says multiple displays. All you want to do is duplicate these displays or extend these displays. Either of those will take care of it and voila, you're all set to go. Hit OK and then uh, you'll have your projector and your computer communicating. All right, folks, have a good one. Take care.